Hi guys, Habib here. Welcome back to my tutorials. In my previous video, I was trying to add my character model to this player character prefab, and now I have and I have it working here. It has walking and idle animation. I'm the skeleton. Let's play. Here you will see this. This skeleton is playing the idle animation, and if I walk, I can see the animation of the character is being played okay but I did not test what if I export the project and what if I run the game as the second player let me build it the exe file here I'm going to run the game on my unity editor as the first player first player let's play and let me place it here then I will play as the second player here Let's play. Let me move somewhere. Okay, that is the second player. Uh, take a look my Unity editor, and here on my Windows application, I'm going to move. Moving forward, I can see the player uh, the character is moving here the animation is being played here on Windows Windows app application but I cannot see it here moving it is still playing the idle animation not the walking animation so there is a problem we got a problem here and how to solve it we need to go back to this player character object and here inside this character model we need to add a component it is very important to add this component to make the character animation working properly on our multiplayer game and the character the component is network uh, mechanism animator just add it here and that's all we can try to rebuild the game and we will see the result okay let me play the game resize the window this is player one and let's play let's start the second client here I can see player 1 and let me move here on unity editor let me move and you can see the animation the working animation is working properly and also if I walk here if you watch my unity editor the working animation now is working properly on both clients 
okay that's all for this video i hope it is useful to you thank you bye bye